I'm Jillian. And I'm Andy. We're here with Jump Real Estate. And Jump Living. And we're here today to talk about water. When you're looking for a house that is on a well, or maybe you live in a house that's on a well and you've been there for a while, um, you obviously know that one of the important things to look for is the flow rate of your well, and that includes the refresh rate and how much uh, the groundwater can refresh your well over time. It's also important, very important, to look at the water quality. We know many people on wells up here who haven't even done well tests at all, or if they have, they haven't done complete well tests. Um, when we moved up here five years ago, uh, we had lived in houses that weren't on wells, and so we wanted to uh, make sure we knew everything we could about it, and Jillian did a lot of research on different aspects of owning a house with a well. Yeah, when we first got our well drilled, I mean, I think we were just happy to get away from city water, honestly, thinking, oh good, we don't have to worry about chemicals in our water. Um, and then when I got the well test done, we you know, went above and beyond and did like the full well test package, which we'd be happy to talk to you about. But um, one of the most concerning things that we came out with was our water having a lot of gross alpha particles, like, I mean, I think, you know, 100 times the safe level and uranium was the most difficult to treat. So anyway, so then we, you know, we're paranoid and I'm asking all the neighbors about everything. And it was amazing how few, how few people had actually tested their wells for these things because it wasn't the coliform or the basic, you know, the basic test that some people get when they move into a house to the well. So anyways, I mean, these things can cause cancer after, you know, extended exposure. So and maybe it's just my personality anyways, but I took it, you know, pretty seriously and was pretty nervous about giving it to our kids. Um, so, yeah. It's very important uh, to get someone who uh, knows what they're talking about, especially in your area. We actually got a lot of different advice from a lot of different people, including a guy from Costco. And um, No, and we also had, I mean, some people I feel like told us not to do anything. So I feel like we had kind of ran, ran the gamut of what to do. Yeah, and I mean, some people said they wouldn't even touch our water quality. And like Jillian said, we should be glowing because of the amount of radiation in our water. But uh, don't get discouraged. There are options for almost every situation. Just make sure you talk to the right people because uh, the local people around here um, are pretty, pretty knowledgeable and have solutions for a lot of different situations. Thanks for joining us today. Check us out at jump-re.com or on Facebook and Instagram at Jump Living. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time.